This is the Daily Market Comment by Mario Sachikiriakos. I'm Cristina Marujos, and thank you for joining us at XM.com. Economic data finally comes back into the spotlight today, as the number of Americans filing for unemployment benefits last week will give us a taste of just how much destruction the pandemic has already left in its path. This print could make or break the latest recovery in stocks. A very high number would suggest that the unemployment rate is set to skyrocket when the nationwide jobs data are released next week, cementing fears of a deep recession. A very disappointing number today, perhaps one above 2 million, could dent risk sentiment and spell more trouble for stocks. However, any weakness in the dollar might be modest and short-lived. The world's reserve currency has been acting like a haven asset lately amid the stock carnage, so if the data today are indeed weak enough to revive fear among investors, the greenback might not stay down for long. In the FX market, risk sentiment held strong for the most part yesterday, with the dollar and the yen being the worst performers, while the loonie raced higher, taking heart from the announcement of powerful stimulus measures in Canada. Wall Street closed higher by 1%, but the Congress-powered rebound seems to have fizzled as futures point to a 2% drop at the open today. A similar situation is true in the currency arena, where the yen is recovering ground early on Thursday, as commodity-linked currencies are left behind. With the Senate officially approving the gigantic stimulus package overnight and the House all but certain to follow suit tomorrow, it's quite worrisome that stocks haven't been able to stage a more impressive rebound. Much of that might be due to fears about today's data, and a lot will depend on their quality. But if $2 trillion in fiscal stimulus was only enough to keep markets afloat for a couple of days, it's a huge warning sign of what lies ahead. As for today, the Bank of England will meet, but having cut rates twice already this month at emergency meetings, any further action today seems somewhat unlikely, especially with the recent tranquility in markets. Thank you for watching the Daily Market Comment here at XM.com.